Hi, my name is Dr. Helen Messier, and I'm the Chief Medical Officer of Viome. I want to take this opportunity to share with you some of the exciting updates that you'll be seeing in your results and recommendations. Now, first of all, I want to thank you for being part of the Viome community. It's really your participation that's enabled many new insights into our understanding the activity of the microbiome and its role in overall health and wellness. Your annual service gives you access to all of these new insights that you'll be seeing in your updated app. These new understandings and insights are the result of a lot of behind the scenes work. Viome is continually collecting and incorporating all of the scientific findings on the microbiome that are published on a daily basis by scientists around the world. We also use the gene expression data of all the organisms in everyone's microbiome and map the transcripts to functional pathway databases that enable an understanding of exactly what all the microorganisms are doing. We can see what they're consuming, producing, and how they're interacting with each other. We're also using the findings from all of our customers to create machine learning models that our artificial intelligence incorporates into very precise and personalized recommendations. And we're conducting a number of clinical studies, and these, of course, are also being incorporated into all of the updates. Now, the first thing that those of you who ordered new kits recently will notice is that they no longer include the metabolic intelligence test. Feedback from our customers encouraged Viome's R&D and artificial intelligence teams to work very hard to define the data and algorithms that allow us to map an individual's blood sugar response based on their gut intelligence data only. Now, if you've received an MI kit already, you're not required to complete the test before getting your recommendations. I'm also very excited to announce an updated microorganism database. Our database is used to match the sequencing data from your sample in order to identify and name the microorganisms that are active in your gut. Now, this is the most up-to-date and comprehensive unique signature database of microorganisms that's available. When we started Viome, we were using the database we received from Los Alamos National Lab. And since then, we've now been able to build an even more comprehensive database that includes over 120,000 organisms at strain level and includes many organisms that were previously unknown even up to a year ago. Now, when you look at the list of microbes in your gut, you may notice that many of the organisms have changed and you may see many new ones. You are the very first to see this level of resolution of organisms in your gut. The old database wasn't wrong. The new one is just that much more precise and robust. We're also happy to share with you a more precise and in-depth scoring system that analyzes thousands of molecular pathways in order to generate new wellness score categories. Today, you'll see scores for inflammation and metabolic fitness, and coming soon will be scores for digestion, detox, and gut neurobalance. The scores take into account both composition and function of your gut microbiome. For example, the inflammatory score looks at production of the anti-inflammatory short-chain fatty acid called butyrate, as well as the inflammation-promoting LPS and biofilm formation, among many other pathways. It also looks at the balance of harmful and beneficial organisms and how they are interacting with each other. Another thing you may notice is that food recommendations are more simplified. In the past, we took your food preferences from your questionnaire data into account in your avoid food list. Now going forward, we will no longer be taking into account self-reported food allergies, sensitivities, or preferences. We really want you to see all the foods that our AI analysis shows would be beneficial or harmful for your microbiome so that you can make the most informed food choices. If you have an allergic reaction to a specific food, that of course is going to take precedence and you shouldn't eat that food. And if you're vegetarian, you have the option under settings to toggle to the vegetarian versus the omnivore, omnivore food list. You will also notice a new supplement page with specific probiotic and supplement recommendations that are chosen based on your specific results to optimize your microbiome activity. If you've already received supplement recommendations from Viome, please finish those first before starting the new ones. 
And of course, always check for allergies before taking any supplements. And it's also a good idea to check with your healthcare provider. When you download the latest version of the Viome app, you should be able to see all of these changes. And thank you so much for being on this journey with us to make chronic illness a matter of choice.